Good afternoon. Good Greetings of peace. Salam, shalom. My name is Sumaya Khalifa. I'm with the Islamic Speakers Bureau of Atlanta. I have the distinct honor of being your MC for this historic event this afternoon, the swearing-in ceremony for Georgia Senator Sheikh Rahman, representing Georgia District 5 from Gwinnett County. <laughs> Today is a celebration of our great country, the United States of America, for the values that are woven into its DNA. Today we celebrate a great American story. We celebrate the values and beliefs that hard work, perseverance, serving others, love for God, country, and community can bring us together to commemorate and celebrate Sheikh Rahman this afternoon. I want to congratulate Senator Rahman on his election. As you know, he was officially sworn in this morning, along with his fellow senators. But he wanted to do something special to bring diverse faith communities and diverse ethnic communities together to celebrate this historic moment in Georgia's history. We celebrate Georgia's first immigrant in the Georgia State Senate and also the first American Muslim. As an immigrant myself and daughter of immigrants, today means a lot to me. On behalf of Senator Rahman, I want to thank the host committee for their support in making today happen. They are Rabbi Peter Berg, Mr. Jason Carter, Imam Pleman El Amin, Reverend Jane Fahey, Reverend William Flippen, me, Valerie, Ms. Valerie Morvan, Rabbi Ellen Neushauser, Bishop Shields, and Reverend Bob Thompson and Graham Younger. I want to thank Bob Thompson for working so hard on making today happen. I also want to thank Faith in Public Life for their support. Our program will start by having faith leaders offer blessings and prayers for our esteemed senator. We will have Rabbi Peter Berg of the Temple, Reverend Jane, she Jane Fahey, um, Ms. Valerie Morvan, representing the Buddhist community, Mr. Yatin Parekh from the Hindu community, and his prayer and blessing will be translated by Konj Pandai. So we will have the faith leaders come on up right now, and then I'll be back after they're done. Good afternoon. On behalf of the clergy and the board and the staff of the temple, I bring my warm personal greetings to this distinguished gathering here today and a, as we say at the temple, mazel tov, a congratulations to our new senator, to Sheikh Rahman. It is good to be together with friends and leaders today Senator, we join with you and your family in sharing in this tremendous milestone for you, for our state, and for us all. The swearing in of our first Muslim immigrant to serve in our state legislature gives us opportunity to pause, to be grateful, and to offer all of our blessings. And so this prayer for our new senator and our state on this exciting day of reaffirmation for our state's ideals and unity. May you, O oh God, whom alone belong the dominion and power, be our senator's stay and support in the fulfillment of his awesome trust to ensure equal opportunities of learning and labor and well-being for all of the citizens of our great state. Shelter to those who seek refuge from tyranny. Safeguard the physical and moral integrity of our state. God, who is the source of all life, Quicken our Senator's heart always with awareness of your presence, and especially the lonely moments of fateful decisions which may be his to make. Guard and guide in your loving kindness that through our great Senator's leadership, 
Hunger may be stilled, hurts may be healed, hope sustained, the weak and the worn assisted, human dignity and decency upheld, peace and freedom prevail among all of your children everywhere and with none to make them afraid. To be here today to celebrate Senator Rahman's courage and leadership, to be on the avant-garde of humanity, for we are one state, we are one people, and we are one destiny. How remarkable it is to be alive, to be sustained by each other, and to arrive at this precious moment in time. In profound humility we pray, O oh God, that your blessings will rest upon our Senator and all who will be blessed to work with him. And if we are weary, give us strength. If we are discouraged, give us hope. If our hearts are chilled by indifference, warm them with mercy and inspire us with the glowing spirit of this sacred gathering. Let us together under the leadership of our Senator come to understand that what really counts in life the most is not the years but the days, not the machines in our lives but the people in our lives, not how much we can accumulate but how much we can share and with whom. Senator, may you be blessed on this journey as you bless each of us with every happiness, with good health, with everlasting peace, with never-ending courage, and always with much love. Amen. Thank you, Rabbi Berg. Now we will hear from the Christian tradition with Reverend Jane Fahey. Good afternoon. It is my privilege to be here as a representative of the Christian tradition. I am a Presbyterian minister here in Atlanta, and it is a great privilege to be with you today to celebrate this wonderful moment. And I invite you to join me in a moment of prayer. Creating, redeeming, and sustaining God we give you thanks for the privilege of public service, the privilege of seeking to ensure the well-being of all our fellow citizens in this state. And we are grateful, especially today, that your servant, Sheikh Rahman, had answered the call to serve in this way, in this place, at this time. We ask, Holy One, that you would equip him with every gift that he will need to serve well, to ensure the well-being of all. Give him a listening heart that he may listen for the needs of all in our community. Give him courage, O oh God, to pursue justice and peace, freedom and reconciliation among all your people. As he looks out those whom he serves and those with whom he works, keep him ever mindful that each person is a child full of dignity made in your image. And O oh God, in those times of disagreement, we pray that you would strengthen him with patience, with wisdom, and keep ever before him your vision for the peace and mercy, justice and reconciliation that is your hope for all, all in our state. So bless him as he undertakes this new calling that he may serve faithfully and with joy. We ask it in your holy name. Amen. Amen. There is a celebration outside for the swearing in inside. Uh, next, we will hear from uh, Valerie Morvan from the Buddhist tradition. 
I thought you arranged to have the cannons go off when you spoke, Reverend Faye. <laughs> Thank you for inviting me as a representative of the Buddhist tradition, and um, welcome to everyone here. It's so nice to see such a lovely, diverse, and smiling crowd. Dear sir, thank you for your willingness to serve. You face many challenges, assuredly, and hopefully as many moments of joy as you fulfill um, your duties in your new role. Thank you so much. I wanted to share with you a, a prayer from the Buddhist tradition, uh, translated from the Pali, the original language that the Buddha's words were taken in. It's called the unlimited friendliness. And um, this serves not just for you, but your, your comrades in service. May all be filled with joy and peace. May all beings everywhere, the weak and the strong, the great and the small, the meek and the powerful, the short and the long, the subtle and the gross. May all beings everywhere both seen and unseen, dwelling far off or nearby, being or waiting to become, may all be filled with lasting joy. Let no one deceive another. Let no one anywhere despise another. Let no one out of anger or resentment wish suffering to anyone at all. Just as a mother with her own life protects her child, her only child from hurt, so within yourself, let a boundless love for all creatures grow. Let your love flow outward through the whole universe to its full height, depth, and broad extent. As you stand or walk, sit or lie down, as long as you are awake, strive for this with one point in mind. Your life will bring heaven to earth. Thank you. Thank you. Now we have the Hindu tradition and Yatin Parekh and Kunj Pandai um, from the Hindu temple. Please join us. Om Sarvatra Sukhina Santo Sarve Santo Niramaya, Sarve Badrani Pashanto, Makasche Dukamapnuyat. Om Hari Om Dyohu Shanti Rantarikshagum Shanti Prithivi Shanti Rapa Shanti Ro Khadaya Shanti Vanaspataya Shanti Vishve Devaha Shanti Brahma Shanti Sarvagum Shanti Shanti Reva Shanti Sama Shanti Redhi Jato Yataha Sami Haseta Tono Abhayam Kuru Sannaha Kuru Prajabhyo Bhayannaha Pashubhyaha Vishwani Deva Savita Durita Niparasuva Jagbadrantana Asuva Om Shanti He Shanti He Shanti He Shushantir Bhavatu Sarvarishta Santir Bhavatu To all the elected officials who begin their term of service today, and especially to our good friend, Senator Rahman, who so boldly began his term with the, uh, a truly moment of unity, um, collecting all the fates, we, we generally, genuinely wish you a great congratulations and um, hope you have the guidance and certainly the blessings to do all that you intend to do in office. Uh, Pujari Yatin Bay uh, from the BAPS Mandir in Lilburn gave a, a profound 
prayer for unity or sump and peace shanti peace for all in the world peace for all those who we may affect knowingly or otherwise peace in the stars peace on earth peace in the environment peace in our minds peace in our hearts and peace for everyone and everything everywhere thank you Thank you, that was so beautiful. Now we hear from Imam Pliman El Amin from the Muslim tradition. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. God says in the Quran, Alam nasrullah ka sadrak, wa waddanna anka wisrak, alladhi anka da thakrak, wa rafa'anna laka thikrak, fa inna ma lusra yusra, inna ma lusra yusra. Have we not expanded for you your breasts and raised high the esteem in which you are held and removed the burdens that nearly broke your back? So verily with every difficulty there is relief. Verily with every difficulty there is relief. So when you are free from your immediate task, still labor hard and to your Lord turn all your attention. To each is a goal, God says, to which he turns you. So strive together as if in a race towards all that is good. And wheresoever you are, God will bring you together with others that are working for good. So we say to you, uh, Sheikh, Sheikh Rahman, that you have been blessed. You are a blessing to us, the Muslim community. You are a blessing to the interfaith community. You are a blessing to the Gwinnett community. You're a blessing to the state of Georgia. And there are three efforts that God reminds us of in the Quran to strive towards. Compete in goodness, compete in forgiveness, and compete in patience and constancy. Work with those and collaborate with those who are working for good. Work with those and collaborate with those in forgiving one another and work with those and collaborate with those in patience. So we say to you, well, we, let me remind you of Dr. King. Dr. King said, on one hand, we must attempt to change the soul, the souls of individuals so that society can be changed. But on the other hand, we must attempt to change societies so individuals will have a chance. This is the work that you have taken on. This is the work that we support you in. And we ask that, that God blesses you to care more than others think is wise, to risk more than others think is safe, to expect more than what others think is possible, and to pray more than what others think is practical. May your presence and your work in this Georgia Senate advance those who have been left behind, remind those who have gone ahead, reconcile those who are divided, help to turn poverty into well-being, turn, to turn greed into compassion, help to turn sickness into health, hypocrisy into sincerity, hate into understanding, despair into hope, and apathy into concern. May God Almighty continue to bless you with graciousness, with benevolence, with mercy, and with su success. I want to close with the opening prayer of Quran, the Al-Fatiha, which, because this is a special opening, I'll give it first in English, and then I'll end with the Arabic recitation. With Allah's name, merciful benefactor, merciful redeemer, praise be to God, the Lord and cherisher, God and evolver all, of all worlds. Merciful benefactor, merciful redeemer, sole judge of the day of judgment, you alone do we worship and your aid do we seek. Show us the straight way, the way of those upon whom you bestowed your blessings and your favors, not of those who have earned wrath, nor of those who go astray. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, alhamdulillah rabbil alameen. Ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, imalik yawm al-deen, إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين إهدنا الصراط المستقيم 
سرات الذين انعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين امين may god be with you about you but that was a very moving part of our celebration today and it represents the diversity of faith traditions that we have right here in Georgia so thank you thank you to all the faith leaders for taking time to be with us next Senator Sheikh Rahman will be introduced by Georgia Senate Minority Leader Steve Henson and he will be sworn in by the Honorable Judge Rhonda Colvin Leary, the first ever African American elected to serve on Georgia State Court from Gwinnett County. It's an honor to have you here, Judge. Thank you. Yay. In the swearing in, the senator will be using the Quran, the holy book for Muslims, for the swearing in ceremony. He will be joined by his family uh, when he is sworn in. After the swearing in, we will hear from the senator. And then after that, you'll, you'll hear back from me. So stay tuned. Thank you so much. It's a great honor for me to be here today. You guys are here to celebrate a great individual. Someone, whether he had gotten to the Senate or not, has contributed much to this country, this world, his homeland, and he is continuing to contribute every day. You know, Sheikh's always been involved and interested in politics and public service. He's done much and had many efforts to help young people and help people in this community. He has ran before for office, but this time he saw a need. He saw what was going on, on the national level. He saw what was going on in his community in Gwinnett County, and he thought that he needed to step forward and provide a voice for so many. I represent part of Gwinnett, and it's burgeoning with different voices, different communities, different ethnic populations, different religions who don't have a voice at the Capitol. You know, it's hard to believe that he is uh, the first of his religion to serve at the, uh, down at the General Assembly. It, it's hard to believe that, maybe not Bangladesh, but really most of the people down here have been, you know, Irish-German ancestry. Italian ancestry, to have someone else bring a different perspective to bridge your communities or his community with other members of this body, to have the senators from Albany and Hayhira and Effingham and Dade County all come and, and interact with Sheikh, see his heart, see his soul, see his commitment of pub to public service is a good thing for all of us. You here being today, means a great deal to him, and I know that he deeply appreciates it. But it means a great thing to our state that he stepped up and ran and broke down one of those barriers that stood between people feeling like they had a chance to participate in the system or people who felt like they were shut out of the system. Because he is here today, more people will go vote, more Bangladesh children of Bangladesh ancestry and other countries, India and Pakistanis and et cetera, will go register to vote. They will be involved in our party and our, not our party, our community, hopefully Democratic Party, <laughs> uh, but in politics and our community and our public service, Democratic Party as well, hopefully. Um, and I know there are many here that are not just Democrats, but here because of Sheikh's uh, commitment. Uh, but get, being involved and feeling like those barriers have broken down between them and the structure that is here to serve people, just very, very, very important. So I, I commend him for his service. You know, he is, before he got here, he had done more, you know, things from successful businessman, opening numerous businesses, to being one of five people in the state on the Democratic National Committee, which is a, a great accolade and honor. He's done a lot already to prove himself uh, uh, a success. He didn't have to take this duty on because, you know, we make far less than 20000 a year. We work 
more than 2,000 hours a year I'll, I'll maintain. We work a lot. It, it really is sacrifice. Uh, for him to take this on uh, will be a sacrifice for him, but it's one that he will take, be excited about, will take as an honor, and, and probably never, ever, ever say that word that I just said, that it was a sacrifice for him, because he is committed to making this state better. I would like to introduce to you the new senator from the 5th District, the Honorable Sheikh Rahman. And good evening, everyone. While Senator um, Sheikh and his lovely wife is coming up to the podium, I am um, Judge Rhonda Coven Leary, and I would just like to say that this truly is a historical day. And I am so honored that uh, Senator Sheikh and his wife invited me to come and administer his ceremonial oath today. Senator Sheikh Rama, are you prepared to take the oath of office by placing your left hand on the, on the Quran and raising your right hand? Yes, I am. Repeat that. Oh, extra. I do solemnly swear or affirm that I will support the Constitution of the State of the United States and I do hereby solemnly swear or affirm that I will support the Constitution of the State and of the United States and on all questions and measure which may come before me on all questions and measure which may come before me I will so conduct myself as will in my judgment I will so conduct myself as will in my judgment be most conducive to the interests and prosperity of this state be most conducive to the interest and prosperity of this state I further swear or affirm that I am not the holder of any unaccounted for public money. I further swear or affirm that I am not the holder of any unaccounted for public money. Do this state or do any political subdivision or authority thereof. Do this state or do any political subdivision or authority thereof. That I am not the holder of any office of trust under the government of the United States. That I am not the holder of any authority thereof in the office of the trust under the government of the United States. Or any other state or any other foreign state. Any which, other state or any other foreign state. Which by law I am prohibited from holding. Which by law I am prohibited from holding. That I have been a resident of my district for the time required by the Constitution. That I am the prohibited, uh, sorry that I have been a resident of my district for the time required by the Constitution. And the laws of this state. And the laws of this state. That I am otherwise qualified to hold said office. That I am otherwise qualified to hold said office. According to the Constitution and laws of Georgia. According to the Constitution and the laws of Georgia. So help me God. So help me God. Thank you. Congratulations. Congratulations. What can I say? I'm blessed. I'm really, truly blessed. A lot of folks were blessed today, but especially at this moment, I can thank all of you, I can name all of you, it will take longer time, but I thank each of you for being here. I could not ask anything more. I could not have, you know, it's just, I don't know, I'm like almost like speechless, I'm voiceless. No doubt about that, no doubt about that, no doubt about that. I'm going to say a word in Bengali, then I'm going to translate. Amar naam Sheikh Muzahidur Rahman. Amar jormo Bangladesh. Ami United States Ashi. 
উনিশশো একাশি সনে এবং আজকে আমি জর্জিয়ার সেনেটর হলাম মাই নেম ইস শেখ মুজাহিদুর রহমান আই ওয়াজ বর্ন ইন বাংলাদেশ আই কেম টু ইউনাইটেড স্টেটস নাইনটিন এটি ওয়ান অ্যান্ড টুডে আই বিকেম এ জর্জিয়ার স্টেট সেনেটর I'm a proud immigrant, but I'm not an immigrant senator. I'm a proud Muslim, but I'm not a Muslim senator. Like you, I'm a Georgian, and I will be a Georgia senator. Right. My ancestry and my faith have shaped me who I am as the shape that Georgia is. We're a land of immigrants, founded by those who sought religious freedom. Our diversity is what makes America great and what makes Georgia great. I'm here to serve this great state of Georgia and represent the residents of 5th District in Gunnett, the most diverse county in the state and one of the most diverse state senate district in the country. I'm here to uphold the Constitution of Georgia and the Constitution of the United States of America. Yes. But above all, I'm here to serve you, whoever you are. It doesn't matter what your religion is or if you don't follow any. It doesn't matter where you or your ancestor came from. It doesn't matter what you look like, what the color of your skin, what language you speak, whatever your sexual orientation is, or which God you believe in. Whichever marks, church, synagogue, mandir, or temple you attend, I'm ready to serve you. from dishwasher to district managers, from store clerk to business owner, from school dropout to university graduate, from almost homeless to homeowner, from campaign volunteer, campaign worker to Democratic National Committee member, and yes, now I'm a Georgia senator. When you're looking at me, you're looking at the American dream. I want the next generation American to look at me and say, if this guy can make it, then I can definitely make it. And I can also fulfill my American dream. I believe in the American dream is still alive, but it is on life support. It's been choked to death by growing income inequality, by lack of access of affordable housing, affordable education, and affordable health care. I and other new senator and state representative have come to bring fresh air to these chambers and pump new blood into the system so that, they, so that the next generation of Georgian can rise to the fullest potential just like I did. I ask all of you to pray for all of us who have been elected to serve. Pray for God to give us wisdom and humility to hold tight to our principle, but open our mind to new perspective. To quote Dr. Martin Luther King, we may have come here on different shapes, but we're all in the same boat now. I'm ready to work with my colleagues from both sides of the aisles and our new governor to find common ground and common sense solution to every Georgian. God bless you. God bless Georgia. God bless America. Ladies and gentlemen, the Honorable 
Georgia Senator Sheikh Rahman. Thank you all for coming, for being part of history. Uh, it means a lot to Sheikh Rahman and his family and all of us to be together as one Georgia, reaching out to brothers and sisters from different ethnicities and different faith traditions and no faith traditions. Uh, Sheikh Rahman would like to get a group picture of whoever is here, and that's going to be the first trick of his uh, tenure as a senator. So um, according to our photographers, the best thing to do is to all come up here and maybe back here and get a picture with Sheikh Rahman and uh, his family. So come on up. Tall people in the back, short people towards the front. We come up here, the faster we can go home. Right here. Okay. Okay. I stay right here. And if you stay right here. Maybe up here in the middle. Yeah. Yeah. That's my center. Yes. So you. So you all. You all three. You all three. You do here and behind. If you people can get behind. Okay. Yeah. We can do something. Okay. Short people behind you. No. This one is the one. You can go in the front. And then get go at that over there. Shakes need, so need to be here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're because right. he, if he stands here, he can stand in front of these okay, people. Okay, some of you. Okay, yeah, like that's good. And there's someone back yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> so, you, so you right here. You, you, you turn around right here. <laughs> you, you, everybody can see. You, you ain't right. Where is Sasha? Um, Sasha, you're right there. Yeah, 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 Okay. Your wife? They're trying to find out. They find out whether we can get the back there because because no, okay, they're trying to find out because normally this reserve right now because the Senate proceeding will go in session. So we'll see if we can get people in the back. Okay. If not, we're gonna go to the state. So don't worry about okay. being right in this row. We can, we've got two rows up front that people can squat in. I'm going to turn to the side. And then I don't know. We want the one that's The huge pictures. I want the pictures. Okay. Oh, 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 now let's show with the blue book. Yeah, okay. And what's this young man's name? Anzar. Yeah, you guys see? Anzar. Okay. Anzar. Nice to meet you, Anzar. Congratulations. And your sister? I think if you would be hi. Hi. My name's Radha. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. You all can go on the side, I believe. You can go on the side because you can take a picture from the back. So. In a long day, we wake up so oh, I know. Know. <laughs> She missed her all classes today. She, she just transferred Georgia Tech last week. And today, <laughs> today, <laughs> I've been class. today, I threw up four times. Oh, uh, nerves, huh? Nerves. Today, I threw up three times in the car, <laughs> and then, um, smart. Well, uh, one time, the last time I threw up in the car, so, we're about to stop, but, um, when it was a female in so I threw up out the window and saw on the Well, no, no, it's the ones in the front, they're okay, they can see out over them. I'm glad you're feeling better now. They're okay, they can see out over them. Oh, and also, the last time I threw up yesterday, 
Yeah. It's kind of like the shark was in the front, then like, this is tall, and then um, this is tall. But see, if you short, you should be in the rear. Short people, short people, short people need to either be there or up here. The first year of Georgia Tech, we're not for sale. Come on, let's tighten up in here. But I had some, I had some, um, tried to make me feel better, but instead, I, and I threw off and just took it out of my mouth. Turn sideways. You're small, people. Some of it came out of my mouth. Anzal, look at the front. Look at it, yeah. Look at it right there. Yeah, stay right there. Okay. Wait, can we do one more? So can we do one more but we're all looking at shit? We want one. Don't get high. Oh, look, I got the way. Okay. Three, two, one, two, three. Okay, wait a second. We got another photographer. Yeah, oh yeah, we got yeah. This is the one we want. This is the Senate. This is the yeah. real. Yeah, official. This is official. Not saying that wasn't yeah, official. Yeah, that's official. Yeah, this is official now. This is official. We can pull this one up.